first hit me, really hit me, when I flew over Gombe National Park, where I've been doing chimpanzee research since 1960. And when I began, the little tiny Gombe National Park was part of the equatorial forest belt that stretched from East Africa across to the West African coast. When I flew over Gombe in 1990, it was a tiny island of forest surrounded by completely bare hills, and it was obvious there were more people living there than the land can support. I realized that one very important fact was we needed to improve the ways that people could get their livelihood without destroying the environment on which actually they and we depend.